finally is here, despite we have had a tough time making it. Now let me introduce to you another modified map from us, the iBook G3 i5. iBook G3 refers to the Outlook and i5 means the powerful engine inside. This video will have a complete review of this machine, how it is outlook, what it can do, and how it differs from the original iBook G3 cam cell and other iBook modified in the internet. This is the top of the iBook, this is the handle, and this is the bottom. We have applied best skin ever onto it to keep it gloss and as the Apple logo is being concealed beneath, now it won't be missing anymore. And this is the side panel with the stereo jack here, USB, Ethernet port, And this is the other side of the iBook G3. The DVD ROM has been replaced by a SD drive because we believe that no people will carry CDs outdoor these days. There are different sorts of iBook G3 clamp cell modification when you Google around, such as changing the color of the case, modifying the LCD with high resolution, changing the traditional hard disk to SSD as a case for iPad, but this is different because we are changing the whole content of it. It is customized to meet the needs of modern world. It has an Intel Dual Core i5 Haswell chip, Intel HD Graphic 5000s, and most importantly, it is running Mac OS X Yosemite. In fact, this iBook G3 mode is not limited to i5 CPU. It could be equipped with i7 CPU. Inside this iBook is the motherboard extracted from the MacBook Air. Therefore, upgrading the OS X is as easy as an ordinary Macintosh laptop. This is the FaceTime HD camera. This is the OC ROM. Oh. When we press this button, the tray will not eject it because we have changed it to a SD drive. This is a 256 GB SD card and insert it. Oops, sorry. And the the SD card will appear uh, at the uh, desktop here. Now let's take a tour with this iBook G3 i5.
about this Mac. This is a Mac OS X Yosemite version 10.10.3. Uh, the motherboard is MacBook Air 11 inch early 2014 processor 1.4 gigahertz Intel Core i5 memory 4 GB and a graphic Intel HD graphics 5000 and a storage 120 GB for the Macintosh HD and um, SD card 259.7 GB this is the menu bar which uh, provide the state uh, the data the statistic of this uh, iBook this is the uh, CPU the upload and download status as I have off the the Wi-Fi this zero now I turn it on and the temperature here the speaker volume and the battery status with uh, the, uh, the battery status we can charge this iBook G3 i5 with this modified UU adapter. Uh, this is uh, modified to match the power supply with this uh, iBook. Now I plug it and the other end to the wash charging. And you can see the local change to charging status here. This is the uh, dock with the, the application I use usually. I will show you some as an example. The photo which is the latest app uh, issued by Apple. Safari in fact um, the Ethernet port in the side panel can be used we can plug a Ethernet cord into it and connect the iBook to the internet now I switch off the Wi-Fi and I will plug the even that cord. You can see that I am navigating the internet. This is Safari. And this is iTunes, iBook. Dictionary, FaceTime. You can see that the FaceTime camera works the notes mail and uh, the launch pair and dashboard <coughs> and this is the system preferences 
Now I will show you the uh, the function keys. Take a screenshot here, zoom in, zoom out, and so on. Uh, with the system preferences, we can config the uh, the iBook G3 i5 to miss our list. This is general desktop and screensaver. Mission control. The display, we can change the resolution here. keyboard, mouse, trackpad, the sound, internet account, and so on, time machine, and click it, and the menu bar will have an icon of the time machine. We can back up this iBook with the SD card just installed it. backing up 2.3 megabyte of 8 GBs and for the launch pack, I have stopped downloading the iMovie and I'm going to resume it. And now it's downloading. With this iBook G3 i5, we can utilize all functions of the latest OS X 10.10. .10. For example, download, install, upgrade apps directly from the App Store. Make FaceTime calls, sending and receiving messages, organizing photos and videos, connecting with other Apple products, iPhone, Apple Watch, iPad and so on, with the USB port, backing up the hard disk with Time Machine, or doing something which couldn't be performed by iPad, like web design. Most importantly, it is still compact and could be carried around. Now the presentation ends here. Thank you for watching this video.